Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today, just as the title says, I'm going to be trying, this is part one by the way, uh, playing as a Cryomancer only, right? It's kind of like a Pyromancer, but I can only use ice magic, okay? And uh, let me just check if this is recording. Yep, everything looks good. I had to use a um, like kind of cheating tool to give myself one ice spell because they're all locked behind bosses so uh, I don't even have it equipped yet but I'll show you which one I gave I gave myself the most basic one called glintstone ice crag and it is kinda strong it requires 15 intelligence and um, 12 FP to cast it and it is actually much stronger than these two so the early game might be easy, right? Like the first few bosses, but it will get hard pretty quick until I find the next uh, ice spells. So yeah, it's, it's just kind of like my other playthrough. I did a playthrough of Dark Souls 3 where I tried to beat the whole game using only Pyromancy, and I did. Um, yeah, this is the same kind of idea, but I just want to see if I can beat the game using only these ice spells. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. And yeah, off I go. I think I did misclick because it looks like some of my mana is missing. But yeah, I didn't attack anything, so it doesn't really matter. Um, and since I can't equip my ice spell just yet, I'm going to just jump off. I'm not even going to try to fight this guy because that would be like, you know, not using ice magic. And uh, because it costs 15 intelligence, I had to start out as the astrologer class. It's the only one that has 15 plus intelligence um i guess i could have also started out as like a wretch or something but then i would have had to find a passive way to gain like five levels because i think you need 15 for the ice crag spell and i would have had to find a staff and all the other stuff so it's just easier just to start out as a astrologer so i'm able to cast it here in this tutorial area okay now i can actually equip the spell do this first and since I'm going to be casting a lot I think I will give myself more mana potions than anything memorize spell let's remove these two and slap on the ice spell and again it's going to be really easy at the start um, magic in general is really strong like just watch I think I one shot him yeah 238 damage it's pretty strong and also it has like frost build up so if I'm fighting against a boss with a lot of health, um, if I can hit them like, you know, I think it's like four or five times in a row, they will lose a chunk of health, like 15%, 20% instantly because of um, Frostbite. Oh yeah, there's a guy up here too, right? Can I hit him? No. I think I'll just leave him. Oh, okay, see, it doesn't one-shot everybody, but it does a great amount of damage. I have to drink a potion. Actually, maybe I should run past some of these guys because uh, I should save some mana for... Oh, the archer got me. Oh, the range is actually not that good. All right. I'm guessing that the Soldier of Godric is anyways going to go down in, like, I don't know, three hits. <laughs> so I'm just going to... Actually, you know what? I have still two potions, so... Should be actually okay. Now I have to drink one. So long as I have like a pretty like a f more or less full mana bar, I think I should be able to kill the boss. Oh. There's a little bit more tanky, and yeah, I should have enough. Let's see how strong this ice spell is. So there he is. We can just cast three spells. Yep, three three hits from the 
glintstone ice crag and he's down super easy but yeah um some other things just to like you know I'm blurting out my thoughts here I do know where a really good staff is um in Kalid which gives you s ranking um scaling with intelligence but I mean there's no reason not to use it right I, if I know where it is I might as well just grab it and I think it will give me a nice boost um, to my damage as well not that that's really a problem <laughs> as you can see almost everything dies in one or two hits but yeah I might as well grab it that could be one of the first things I get after the horse So, yeah, let's just make a kind of a beeline for the horse. Just grabbing some stuff here. Um, another thing is I'm going to... Of course I could get invaded, but I think you can only get invaded if you are... Um, what's it called? If you... Uh, if you use that item to summon people in, right? So most likely I'm not going to get invaded too much, which is fine. Nope, oh, didn't pick that up for some reason. Whatever. I'm not going to fight uh, the horse guy just yet. I think my health is pretty bad. Oh, there's the Santa guy I could buy from him. Let's... Yeah, a crafting kit, exactly. There might be items to craft. Like, um... Actually, you know what? I will buy from him. There could be items to craft, like, um... That restore mana or boost your damage, right? So, I'm not going to use anything that attacks. But it does make sense, for example, to craft stuff that does like you know boost your damage somehow also I'm gonna grab the torch because why not Could slap the torch on here oh and I'm gonna get rid of the sword because I don't want to use anything but ice magic actually I can get it yeah like this this is good uh no don't need to or actually I should light it though and yeah let's get the horse and we can also get Ronnie. You know, she gives you, like, the wolf summons and stuff, which I won't use, but... Hey, you never know. If the challenge gets so hard and I need something to... At times to, like, summon, maybe I will, but I'll try not to, you know? If the boss is, like, impossible for me somehow. But, uh... Yeah. I think I will just go like this. Oh yeah, okay, they also are a bit tanky. Uh, I'm here, I might as well do this. It's like a little... Oops, I wanted to take the torch out. This is like a little kind of mini-boss. Um, we can test our magic without any upgrades and stuff, just to see how strong I am against him. Probably I will also kill him easily. Oh, quite a chonky wolf. Let's see if we can sneak this one. Oh, no mana. Gotta watch the mana. Can I reach him from here? No. <laughs> it's too far. Oh, there's another one sneaking up. He missed, though. Cracked pot. Nice. Don't wait. Don't get up, guys. Just keep sleeping. Uh, maybe I should go back to get more mana. Then again, I have to. Oh, there's more wolves, though, also. 
checking if there are any more. I think that's it with the wolves. So if I drink a potion... I probably have enough. Hope I don't die. But, yeah. Who knows? Let's put the torch away. Okay, there he is. So we can test out our... Whoa. He actually just ro somehow went through one of my spells. If we're lucky, we'll get to see a proc. I think that might have been a proc. 270 damage. Let me see how much... Yeah, normally it's just 191. Oh, oh shit. Okay, I should run away a little bit. Let him do something, and then... Heal mana, heal HP. Whoa. Not today, buddy. Look at that. First tried him. A little bit of kiting, and, uh, yeah, that's it. Might as well slap that on. Cool. Really easy. Plus, I got now some runes, you know, which is nice. Uh, when we go now meet the girl, um, Millennia, or whatever. Let's just run straight there. Let's go get our horse. It's been a while since I played Elden Ring. Like, I played with a friend a while back. Um, but yeah, now I've deleted that character and I just created this one. I want to play as a Frost Mage, you know? A Cryomancer. Okay, we made it. Easy peasy. Rest. Skip the cutscene. Have a serve at you. I can play turning you to aid you if you need to the foot. Then if summon me, ah, I bequeath. It will sound torrent. Treat him with. Okay, let's level up. Let my share them with me. Um. Your thoughts. Your ambition. I'm gonna go with vigor because my HP is really low. He starts with 9. Actually, the other stats are pretty good. Like, I don't need Strength or Dexterity or Faith or Arcane. He starts with kind of high Dexterity for some reason, though. And, yeah, 16 Intelligence. Very low Endurance, very low Vigor. And the Bind is also very good, though. And then, um... Is there anything else I want to do? No. I think that's it. Um... Uh, I always do this. Now we can get the map real quick. Or actually, we can get the items as well. Come on. Yeah. Oh, it's just like a sword. I don't actually have to fight all the enemies. Just some of them. Okay, they're all going down with two hits, but even if you start a new game, you're going to be doing about the same amount of damage. They're really, really easy. Oh. Hmm. Sometimes they drop, like, their armor. Oh, I forgot about this guy. get used to seeing that spell a lot until I find my next magic, you know, my next ice magic. It's going to be a while. Oh, he blocks. Okay. I think down here you can get like a whetstone or something, um, which is kind of useless for me. Oh yeah, an Ash of War, War Stomp. I'm not going to be using any Ashes of War, because I don't think there are any ice-based 
Ashes of War. So, yeah. Oh, here's another guy. Oh no. <laughs> um, oh, since it's night time, I can quickly teleport back to Kale and get those uh, summon spirits, even though I don't really need them either. Might as well just start it. Uh, her name is Rena. But I think it's her real name is like Ronnie. Okay, see ya. Um. Right. Okay. So the next thing that I want to do is maybe get that staff. <laughs> so I'm gonna just teleport back here. Just just to get my build going a little bit, you know. It's it's better to have like a S scaling staff right away. So I just do more damage. And the easiest way to get it is to teleport to Kaelid. Okay, I'm going to drop down here. Oh, I thought it would take fall damage. That's horrible. Someone's screaming there in the pit. Right, so just riding, riding, riding. Hop over this stuff. And there's an entrance somewhere. Oops. Let's go down here. There's a couple of rats. Let me see if I can sort of stealth them. Oh yeah, nice. What's that? Oh, there's two more. Okay. Oh yeah, okay, let's go for this one first. Okay, easy peasy. That's all of them, I think, yeah. And check this, this will this is a trap chest. It's really cool because it just teleports you um to Kaylid. I'm just gonna quickly check if Yeah, looks like it's recording, right? Yeah. I I'm always paranoid, so yeah. <laughs> okay, so the build is actually getting there. I just need to get that staff. Oh my god, the load times. grab it while I'm here. And if anyone ever does this, I kind of learned this by trial and error. You can actually sneak here. And as long as you stay near the house and just keep sneaking, 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 you can even like run sneak. Um, you should not get attacked by those weird centipede dudes. Now you can just run normally. Um, yeah, even at a very low level, like a level one wretch, those guys do a lot of damage. They can like maybe even one shot you. So it's better to just sneak by. Uh, let's grab this. Okay, also grease, like rock grease, fire grease, whatever others, like poison grease. I'm never going to use it. So I can sell that stuff if I find a merchant down the road, you know, just to get some more souls. Um, yeah, so... <sighs> now I just need to find the building with the staff in it. I ha I think I know where it is. It's, it's like a little towery looking building. Mm, yeah, it's the one... It, I don't know if you can see that so well as I can because it's kind of foggy. Um, But it's the one behind the one that's straight ahead of me. So not this one, but... Actually not this one either. It's this one that has like a tower. This one here. And if you run past these little guys, eh, you might have to jump. There, we got the staff. I'm not gonna even try to equip it. I don't wanna get Scarlet Rot. Let's get the hell out of here. And there is a bonfire. Just go south from there and climb up this thing. Climb over this thing. And there we go. De-aggro all those guys, you know, that are, are trying to kill you. Like the plants and, I don't know, those skeleton things or whatever. Okay, cool. Oh! Okay. Uh, yep. 
forgive me to determine if I think she's going to take me to the round hold. Which is cool, but like totally useless at the moment. She almost looks like she's proposing to me. <laughs> cool. Okay, now I have the round hold table, but I don't care that much about that. Uh, we can go straight for Margit and see how much damage we do with our rinky dink weapon and uh level. But I think it's better to do things like go in this cave. Yeah, let's actually let's go in this cave first because we already did the other one. Um, we can also talk to a guy. I think he's like right here, and he can help us kill an NPC that's like here. So yeah, let's just do that actually. Let's teleport to this one. I think it's good. Okay. Let's go back down to the lake. There's also a dragon that we can try to fight and kill. Um, oh, yeah, and one more thing before we keep going. Let me equip the better staff. Oh, I need 18 intelligence, and I have 16. Okay, that's fine. I just need to level up twice. No biggie. Grab these flowers. You never know if you want to do, like, online stuff. Okay, we're almost at the cave. And actually, I would recommend this to everyone who's like, you know, playing melee builds and stuff like that. This cave is really good to collect a bunch of um, smithing stones. You can get like... Actually, you can get infinite here, the, the first level ones, because the enemies drop them, these minor dudes. So you can kind of farm. I think you need like 12 to get your weapon to plus 3? 2... I don't know, something like that, yeah, like 12 of them or something. Let's just check how much damage we do. Oh, okay, we one-shot them. Nice. So that's one. Let's see how many we can actually get. Two. Actually, I don't even have to count because I can just check afterwards. I think I have none right now, so... Oh, no, I did start with... Hey, where did I get those other ones? Okay, so I already have, like, five. I wasn't paying attention. Maybe I picked them up from somewhere. Um, wait, there's rats in here. Oh, there's one. Another smithing stone, so that would be three from the cave so far. Number four, I think. Yep. All very, very easy. So you can get your Uchi Katana or whatever weapon you're using. Like normal weapons. There's something written here, I think. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes actually it is worth jumping. Like, you can jump down, and there might be even stones like in these little, like, you know, alcoves, these little caves here. Um, this time it doesn't really look like it. Which is okay. Let's just go down here. I'll pull the elevator down. Okay, there's like a dog. One shot the dog. One shot the guy. Oh, a dog and a guy. Okay, I think that's all of them in here. Here's another item. Glintstone scraps. Okay. That's another one. I think I was at four now. Or five now. Whatever. As you can see, there's a lot of those level 1 stones in this cave. Super easy to get them. 
Yeah, I think it was like five. Um, yeah, let's go up. And here I have to jump off, actually. This would be number six. Oh, no. I think that would be number seven. And once again, we can try jumping off here. Oop. Okay. Lucky. Oh, yeah, there's an item, see? It was worth it this time. Golden rune. And a somber smithing stone, which is also very good for, um, yeah, obviously somber weapons. Okay, cool. We made it to the boss. I don't know if I have enough mana. We can still try. Was there... Yeah, I have the Statue of America, so if I die, I just start right here. Oh, and check this out. That's like number eight. <laughs> so many. All right, let's just try it. No big deal if I die. Pretty sure I do enough damage, though. As long as I don't miss too much. Oh, yeah, look at that damage. That's pretty sick. Nice. Let's drink the last one we have. Let's do quick casts. As long as you run, like, under him. Look at that. Easily. You only need one potion. With ice magic. That's not going to help me. Okay. Awesome. That was it. Oh! Oh no. I thought for a second that candle was another stone. But as you saw, I think you get like around eight smithing stones from that cave alone. So, yeah. It's actually pretty nice. Um... I could try fighting the dragon, but um, maybe I ought to level up first a bit. So I'm going to try to avoid the dragon. But if you see to the where the bonfire is, behind the bonfire, there's like this arched looking kind of bridge thing. That's where I'm going to go next. Let's see if I can get there, though. As long as you avoid the bonfire, the dragon doesn't come swooping down. So, yeah. Also, by the way, I think I didn't check for items here, so I'm just going to do that real quick as well. I might have missed a treasure chest or whatever else. Oh, yeah, or something like this. Ooh, another golden rune. Very nice. Uh, a second grade golden rune. Yep, there, I knew there would be something in here. Stone, stone sword key. Oh no, come on. Get away from them. Oh yeah, and that's where it, that's the thing that leads you, I think, uh or wait a minute. Oh, this looks like a different entrance. Let's go check it out. I'm just gonna go down. Yeah. Before there was a room with rats. Oh, it's just a chest here. Twin blade? Oh wow, nice. I didn't know it was there. It's pretty good. I think it's a dex weapon. Yeah, you need 18 dex, 10 strength. Um, oh, it has a scaling in D in both of them. It's a pretty cool weapon if you want to... You know, if you take, like, the samurai or something that has good dex. Could be a nice early game weapon. Uh, where am I? I think I want to go over here. Some more flowers. Yeah, there's this dude here who can help me out with this little NPC encounter. I'll do well to silence this for 
So, stay clear. Don't. Don't. Okay, cool. Let's try... Hmm. Either I can try fighting the dragon, which would be kind of cool. Or I can go to the next cave, Patches Cave, and fight Patches. And also there's an NPC outside who's actually harder than Patches. But, uh, yeah. The dragon, I think I'm going to need more mana. So let's le firstly, let's level up. We can put two in here to use the staff. And, yeah, more vigor. And then I'm going to swap the flasks. I'm just going to try not to get hit by the dragon. I'm going to stay on the horse. You'll see my my strategy. Oh, and now, obviously, you have... Because I have... Now I can wield this. Like, look at that. My damage goes from 117 to 138, I think. So that's pretty nice. All right. So far, it's not too bad with the ice magic only. And um, I wonder if there will be, like, ice bosses or something or things that are resistant to ice and frostbite. Then I'm probably going to have a hard time, but, you know... Oh, there he is. Let's immediately start casting. Okay, let's see what he does. You have to always watch what the dragons do in the game. Yeah, so this is actually pretty easy to evade. Oh shit, I already ran out of mana. Yep, he's going to do his burning attack. And he's probably going to land somewhere over here. Nice. One in the face. Oh. Let's see. I think he's going to dive bomb. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. I think most of his attacks are just going to be, like, almost lethal. Because I have so little health. Let's see what he... Oh, he's going to do... So, again, let's ride to the side. Oh. No, 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 no. Not good. Not good. Not good. Oh, lucky, 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 lucky. Wow, that was just pure dumb luck. If I can hit him in the head, I think he does more damage, so... He is almost dead. I think he's gonna do the dive, yep. Dude, first try. Whoa, not good. Come on. Anywhere. Why is it... Oh, shit, it's it's targeting those damn things in the back there. Oh, shit. But actually, this is very good for me. Because I can just get up under him, and that's it. Dragon down. First try. Nice. Very nice. Really cool. I think even that guy now has different dialogue. When you kill the dragon and go back to him, he says like, oh wow, you beat the dragon or something like that. So, let's go check it out. <laughs> Not too bad. Oh, I think I have to be dismounted. Fear not such. The heart, if you should find it and seek the do Nice. No super no hunger until the first strand is no super. So yeah, like I said, early game, super easy. Even the dragon, like not not really uh even if I would have died it would have been easy to try to fight him again. And uh yeah, now I'm gonna just put a little quest thing uh marker down here. Cause now we can do Oh, before I go there, though, let me obviously level up. 5,000. That's quite a lot. Four level ups. Oh, okay. Um, Maybe two more in Vigor, so I just have a nice amount. Intelligence I don't really need just yet. Yeah, I think I will go for Mind. 
And then, um, I'm going to do this, because, yeah, I don't want to run out of uh, heals. Okay. This is going much better than I actually anticipated, so, yeah, I'm happy. My Cryomancer. He does look a little bit like an Ice Mage. He's wearing all white, you know. Or then again, he looks kind of like Assassin's Creed. But, uh, whatever. Okay. The next boss is not really a boss. It's an NPC invader. And he can be annoying, so that's why I talked to that samurai guy first. Because that guy will help me out. Oh, they're shooting at me. Let's get away from those guys. Oh yeah, see, already they um, sort of dismounted me from my horse. The guy spawned somewhere over there. I think the cave is blocked off, right? Yeah, shoot. Just gonna retreat back a bit until the samurai guy appears. There he is. He's just making a beeline for me. Bloody finger. Nergis. Uh oh. Yeah, see, Bloody Finger Yura now it shows up. Bloody Finger, the end is nigh for you and your sister's blood. Actually, I'm doing pretty good by myself. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh, I almost got stuck in the terrain there. I think he's scripted to roll. Oh shit. Yeah, that's... That's really nasty attack. Come on. Help me out, Samurai Man. Yeah. Now I have to wet the samurai kill him. Ran out of mana potions. Oh, no, don't die. <laughs> Look at them. One more and it's over. Oh, he missed. Uh-oh. Now it's over for me. Maybe I can run away, but I doubt it. Yeah, I thought this might happen. So I'm going to just run over here until he de aggros or despawns or whatever and just try again. If, if he does. <laughs> I think I was a bit greedy with the magic. Ah, there we go. Okay. Now I can get back on the horse, right? Yeah. I wonder if there's a bonfire closer to this, because it's kind of annoying um, riding all the way across the lake just to sort of fail. Let me just check up here. I think there was one. I think there's a bonfire, like, here somewhere, so let me just check that. Oi! You, you there! Could you help us out, Cully? Yes. 
Dobby. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Huh? Okay, there's a bonfire here. It's kind of close. That's the problem with the early game, running out of mana. Hmm. Maybe we'll come back to this because, yeah, I don't want to lose mana again and just... Uh, another thing that I actually wanted to do was get over here somewhere. So, there's that physic, the flask. I think that would be really helpful. So maybe I'll do that. All I have to do is follow the road. And it should take me pretty much straight to it. Okay. Another smithing stone. And, yep, here we have to go this way. Down this dirt road. Wow. Big earth tree. I'm just avoiding all these enemies because, yeah, it makes no sense to now fight every single one. Maybe big enemies I can try fighting since I do solid damage. Ah, yes, the guy on the bridge. We can talk to him real quick. I think under the bridge is an item. Yeah, there's some items here. You can ride in. Who might be in the great Kenny Pike. These monkeys screaming at me. Grant me sucker? What? <laughs> well, fellow, despite it, might have been tarnished. I want you to knight. So now we have another little mini quest to do, which is kill some knight dude in his uh, castle. Which is also pretty easy. I'm guessing also with the ice magic, it will be like no problem at all. Uh, let's ride down here. I hear a scarab. Oh, it's a red one. Oh, we could check, see how much um, damage we do to this guy. Come on. Oh, there was a proc. Look, he's on ice. He's like all iced up now, you see? So he is affected by frostbite. We can wait until that goes away or just keep casting. I don't think it lasts. Oh, shit. He hit me. Or actually, let's just... Maybe it procs again. Oh, no. Or we just kill him. Come on. Boom. 1,000 souls. Nice. Probably can level up again. There's the warping thing back there. But more important, there's like... Uh, one of these is that physic thing. Oh, a sacred tear. Yeah, this one I meant. So, oops. Let's rest. Okay, now my potions will heal me more. Ah, millennia. Melina. Whatever. Spoken words, if you wish. Let's just progress her quest. Um level up oh I don't have enough I guess I would have to spend some runes okay cool or we can just kill that guy again on the way back um hmm. why don't we kill the knight it's easy 
Alright. We can do that, guys. Little sub-quest there. Side quest, whatever. It's pretty easy. Also, was that a scarab? Huh. Must be hearing things. Stay on the road. Yeah, we don't want to fight bears. <laughs> they don't give you that many souls, I think. Okay, we found the map for this area. Oh, shit. Another item. It's cool, because you can just ride past everything. There's no need to fight every single enemy. The werewolf dude. Can you see him from here? I think he's up there. Or where, where is he actually? Normally he's up there like howling. Yep, yeah, there he is. You can't really see him that well, but yep, yeah, there's the werewolf guy. And uh, if you snap your fingers, he comes down. Alright, the bear woke up, but I don't care. I'll just go inside. Talisman. Charge attacks. Okay. Yeah, that's not really of use. Let's see if the bear... Maybe we can, like, sort of... You know, like, cheese the bear. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Let's see how much damage we do to him. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, I don't want to get hit by him. Need need to free aim it. Ah, drink. Yeah. Whoa. He's really aggressive. There we go. Oh, he gave me more salts than the than the giant. Road should be here. Yep. <laughs> it's not an item. Okay. And it's worth coming here, not only to do the guy's quest, but there's also this, this like metal, metal thing or piece of metal or whatever, that you need. It's like half of a key. Um to get up to this Landell or Landell or whatever it's called the yeah later in the game so you need it anyways at some point this is only giving me 5 but yeah why not I guess I could start to boost intelligence as well for more damage but whatever let's let's do this let's see if I can do this little mini quest here Oh yeah, there's a seed here. Nice. That could be another potion. Let's just... Oh, that's also a guy I could try fighting later. Just to see. I'm just going to run past all this stuff. Ah, the rats. Let me see. I have to get up there. The knight is up there somewhere. I think I have to kill these guys, though. Just so that... So that I can actually fight the knight in peace. See if anything followed me up. Oh, yep. Yeah. This guy followed me up, so might as well. Oh, wow. Okay, he's sort of stuck, so I'm just going to leave him there. Let me see if I can quickly kill the knight. Or there's a trick you can do. You can get the knight and then climb up the tower. Yeah, and then you can hit him a couple of times. Or make him even fall down. See if I can. I think he is climbing up after me. 
grab the metal real quick. Yeah, you see? There we go. It takes him some time to get out. Oh, boy. Whoa. Okay. He's not that bad. He gave me, um, bloody slash. Okay. I think most of the enemies probably de aggroed now. So that was the quest for the guy, you know, he's like, kill that knight. Yeah. It's very easy with ice magic. <laughs> it's, so far, it's very, very easy. But I think even if I was playing with regular spells, it would not be much different. But that frostbite proc that happens once in a while, you know, like it just randomly triggers, is really nice. Oh, these guys are still here. Okay. Maybe we can... Oh. Oh, wow, he actually hit me. Wait, let me see if I can sort of roll off here. Yep. Throw it. Cast. Dead. Good. Oh, another knight. And a rat. Okay. Oh. The sneaky bastard tried to stab me in the back. There's a rat right here. I could see it. What the hell? Lock on. There we go. Uh, anything else? Oh, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was close. Sneaky little bastards. Coming around the corner just to, uh, to hit me. Oh, another rat. Some rats. So much kiting, you know? You just walk backwards and hit him. <laughs> it just randomly started to rain. Nice. The weather system is cool in the game. But I actually don't think it does anything like... Maybe, maybe lightning spells get stronger in the rain. I don't know. We could try... Yeah. Oh, shit. Wrong one. Ah! He has bleed. But I have frostbite. Oh, it procced. You saw it did 197. Very nice. So that guy was definitely more resistant to magic. Or ice, I don't know. But, yep, the proc is very nice. Then it just does a flat, almost 200 damage. And I think it lowers their defense or something. I forget what Frostbite does, but I think it, like, lowers their defense for a little bit while they're frostbitten. Okay. Yes. Thank you. And we can probably... Nope. Oh, we only need 200 more. Let me see if I have... Perfect. Yep. Just enough. Um, I think I will still go with mind until this hits like 20-ish, just so I have more casts. Okay. Uh, where to next? Oh yeah, we can teleport back to here and then talk to the guy real quick. And then, now that we heard the werewolf howling, we can talk to Kale as well. The merchant, the little Santa Claus dude, and, um, you know, he gives us this snap, 
emote thing. Which, um... Hold on. Yeah, let him do his little... Oh. Okay, well... Nice. Easy 1,000. I'm not gonna farm, but... This is a pretty good place to get a quick 1,000 souls. It's literally right outside a bonfire, so, yeah. If I ever need, you know, around 1,000 souls, it's a good place to just grab them real quick. Okay, let's kill that. Where's that guy here? Did you more? Well done. I knew it. Okay, he gives you some dagger. What's that, Luel? And even the witch's why Just you. Would you like? I see bright enter. Do you know what say? Sure. I need. I shall officially hold the set. I see good. Oh, now. Wait, what? I have to go back to his fort again? Okay, I can do that in a minute. But first, let's do this. Since it's sort of on the way to the werewolf, right? I might as well. Uh, do Fort Height, do the ceremony thing, whatever. Yeah. Cool. Goodbye. So, we can... Let's just put it here. Which one is the snap? No. This one. And that will make the werewolf guy jump down once we go back to him. Um, let me just check what he sells. <laughs> yeah. Some cookbooks. Oh, he sells these are also good, but I don't want to use pots, right, to throw at enemies, like fire, like fire pots or poison stuff. Unless I absolutely had to. He sells some armor. Yeah, I think I got everything that I need from that guy. So, let's go... I'm actually curious about the whole Fort Height thing. Where is he, though? Uh, maybe somewhere else on the map? What? He was here. Now he's... Is this him? No. Huh? Okay, that's weird. He disappeared. I don't know. Anyway, we'll teleport here, and then we're going to go try to get... um. Blade, the half-wolf. And I know what he ha that this starts like his quest as well. He wants you to, he wants to actually to go right here, and kill a boss. So we can actually fight the boss together with him. I could kill the boss also alone, but why not? I want to do his quest, right? I think he. I don't even know what they give you anymore, but if you do the quests of the NPCs, they give you stuff. That's also why I uh, talked to the samurai guy and let him help me fight against this uh, this NPC invader. I think he also has a quest. So, he's up there somewhere. Let's do the, the snap. He's gonna jump down, yep. There he is. Hmm. Blight, Blight or what? Darryl and in need. All right, let's let's go uh, let's go kill that guy then. Okay, the closest would be here, I guess. And then we just ride down and fight this. Besides that one thing I got in Kaled, I'm not going to explore outside of this first island area. Otherwise, I'm just going to get really really OP. But there is another ice spell somewhere like here, so I might do that at some point. But first, I would like to try to fight Margit and also. Um, Whatever his name is, the guy with the dragon arm. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I mean, like, on my own. Not with these crazy strong spells. Because right now, you know, this spell is doing pretty good damage. It's not too bad. Okay, we just need to ride south. Follow the road this time. 
And right there is where we killed the dragon, right? The big lake. Ah, there's also another boss here. At nighttime, there's this this dude on a horse, but he's also quite chonky. He has a lot of health. And, uh, yeah, just like the one at the main starting area, the guy on the horse there with the halberd, they're kind of similar, and they, they hit pretty hard. They can kind of, like, one-shot you. So maybe I will leave them for a little bit later and come back, yeah. Oh, if we kill one of these guys, we can stop the wagon. Let me just kill one of them. Or both of them, why not? Okay, one more ought to do it. It doesn't even count as an enemy. It's not even using stamina. Awesome. So now I have to be kind of fast to get this chest here. Oh, shit. I don't think they saw me, so I'm kind of lucky. Okay, it's just an axe. get out of here and yeah over here in these ruins is like a sorceress uh she is uh where is she actually maybe in here i forget there was like an entrance somewhere to go downstairs i think maybe maybe she is just here wait what i forget or it's here oh yeah it's here it's here it's here it's here Maybe she sells good staffs or something. Oh, there's a boss fight, even. Yeah, let, we could try it. It's just 3,000 souls, so... Oh, it's this guy. Okay. We already sort of killed one of them. Oh, ow. Let me use this. Come on. Oh, shit. Oh, that was lucky. It's just kiting. Ooh, did you see that proc? Wow. That I, that was a lot of damage. Like, four, almost 400. Two more. And drink and roll. Oh, shit. No, don't die now. Don't die now. Okay, I think I got him. Nice. Woo! Nice, a bonfire. Haha. <laughs> oh, there's a door here, too. Let me open this real quick. Yeah, there she is. Nice, some early game sold. <laughs> yeah. Pretty good. 20 so far. Maybe I can start to put some in intelligence. Promise, shall we? I, am sorry you hit. <laughs> yeah, well, I want to learn cryromancy sorcery, like ice sorcery. <laughs> Very well, but I refuse to anticipate. So we started her quest, I guess. I think she doesn't sell anything ice related. Nope. Cool. But still, it's nice to... Oh, maybe there's some... Can I talk to her? Does she have something to say? Young, you are a, tad so a tadpole. No. Okay, cool. Very easy. Oh, I wonder if I could have rode around the pumpkin head guy on my horse. That would have been hilarious. Ah, well. So let's go down here. Some more items to pick up. Just gonna avoid all these guys. Whoa! And we're almost at the next boss. Where Blade or how did how did he call himself? Blade? Blade? Blade something? I don't know. The werewolf dude will help me in the fight. Um which is good. He can be distraction. I can just cast, cast, cast. Okay. 
Actually, now that we're here, I have 17. How much do I need to level up? 26. So I need like 900 souls. I can just check if I... 4. 4. That's 8. Yeah, not enough. Oh well. Maybe after the boss. So... We'll skip all this. Oh, I just got another... Well, okay, whatever. I just found a rune. Two. Which I think is also then 400. But, yeah, whatever. Th this this boss here will anyways give us a bunch of souls, so it's fine. Just need to survive. We go over here. I'm just running through the early game here, clearing out all these bosses. And yeah, you can summon him in. It's like his arch nemesis, and this will also progress his quest, I think. Oh, oh shit. Nothing in this cell is no true justice. No. This is where it ends. Yeah, see, for a caster, this boss is really nasty. Ooh. Let me actually take this moment to heal. Alright, easy peasy. Man, I don't think he even I hit him one time. Useless werewolf. What is that? Oh. Just gonna check out what that weird, like, rift in the ground was. And, uh, yeah, let's go talk to him real quick. How to work for it, honestly, I'm not a man of my. Oh, he gives you a stone, okay. Oh, yes. If you venture, tell him I can still be sure to treat I owe you on As it is time you part. Okay, see you around, buddy. Um. So we did this, we did this. Just trying to remember, you know, it's been a while. There's a lot of early game stuff you can do. I think there's like a cave right here. And, oh yeah, we could do patches next. Um. What's closer? I think actually this one's closer. <coughs> yeah. So let's level up again. Maybe a little bit more into intelligence for more damage. Wow, look at that. I'm already like level 20. Yeah. So let's go back towards the lake. If we go towards the bridge, yeah, it should just be under the bridge actually. Is it nighttime right now or not yet? No, nope, not yet. Because then you could fight this uh, other horse guy. I could have just. I don't actually really want to fight him. I just want to see how much damage and stuff I do. Okay. So let's try this again. Yeah, this should be much easier this time. Because I have also four mana potions. out somewhere here. Yup. I think my spells are so slow, the, the, ca the actual projectile, that like he will like roll but still get hit. Yeah. As long as he rolls forward or whatever. Okay, we made him waste one of his potions, which is nice. This should go better. Yeah. Oh, shit. I need to. Oh, oh, oh not good. Let me lock off and... Oh, roll, roll, roll. No! Okay. Well, he got me. He's really annoying because... That samurai guy takes forever to join. Whatever. It's not impossible, it's just really annoying. Try again. Uh, 
pretty sure I could, like, kill Patches. Or, um, not kill him, but get him down that he just, uh, gives up. Alright. Also, these... These guys are so annoying because they follow me. Let me get my souls. Yeah, whatever. Let's just run past them. Come on, spawn. So... <laughs> wow. It actually hits. Yep. Oh, shit. I'm just running backwards to see if I can, uh... If it isn't there, yes. Oh, shit. No, bad. Oh, man. That was so dumb of me. Oh, and he starts fight. Okay, I'm gonna actually kill those two spear dudes. So he gets distracted by them, and then doesn't help me. Arrgh. Damn. That was actually pretty good. And I noticed if you cast one, he will roll forwards and get hit. But if you cast two, he rolls forward and then to the side. And only one hits, and you waste mana, so... Yeah, I'll cast one, back up, cast one, back up, that kind of thing. Maybe I can even kill him before the samurai gets to him. So, I will also kill these two spear guys. If I can. Yep, there they are. I don't care about the archer so much. Oh yeah, they're really easy. Oh, there are these ones, okay. Okay, they're both dead. Nice. Got my souls. And, yeah. Close the distance a bit. Where is he? Oh, well. Okay. Let's wait for him to get a little bit closer. Like, right about now. Wow, he's like so dumb. If it isn't there, yes. Fuck. Oh shit. Yeah. Hopefully he distracts him for a second. Good distance. Okay. Oh. Now he's coming after me again. What the hell? Come on, samurai. There we go. Oh. He always dodges, like, last second. Come on. Yes! There we go. Quite a lot of souls. And that might progress the Samurai's quest line. I don't know. So I just always let him join me. Any bosses that are like that guy are going to be really nasty, though. If they're, like, pushing me and pushing me and pushing me. Uh, four. Or actually, I could sit real quick. Two eight five seven. So if I, or actually, I'll just probably the what's his face gives you some 
runes. There's a couple of henchmen down here, but nothing too dangerous. Yeah. I think that was a poison pot. Yeah, easy. Okay, useless mushroom. Yeah, now it's time for patches. He's very, very easy. In fact, for Caster, he he sort of has his own like little breath spell, and that's like the perfect time to actually attack him as a caster. Because he has that great shield, right? And that's a little bit annoying um, if he has it up. Maybe I'll even use a potion. Why not? He jumps down from up there. There he comes, yeah. Actually, the spear, that's what I don't want. I want him to breathe. There we go. Oh. oh, that's also not good. I think one more and he will go down. Yeah, this is good. Very easy. Well, finally come round, have you? <laughs> I knew you would. You're a man of grievance. True and true. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> well, what do you mean? Now, how did I took you for an innocent? Well, water. I'm tarnished only for Nice. That starts Patch's quest. So don't I'll be ready to. <laughs> I'll be ready. He sells stuff at some point to you, so it's good, yeah, just to start his little quest there. Okay, that was Patches' Cave. <laughs> Very easy. Hardly any challenge. Uh, but I'm going to rest real quick. Wait, how, how much do I need? 2857. Ah, oh, damn. If I use 200, it's still not enough. So I'll just... Do this. I guess at the next bonfire, it's fine. Let's get out of the cave, then I can teleport. Yeah. Also, just out of curiosity, what is at the end of this river? Does it just like end here? Oh, ah, there's another cave. Oh, cool! I actually didn't know about this. Hey, the samurai guy's here. Ah, the fort Nereus and lived when you were a tarnished held you stayed apart. Just remember, don't let your emotions be on your way. Perhaps we will. Nice. Poison bloom. Oh, some of these guys. Okay. Actually, this is interesting. I don't think I ever went this way. Oh, there's even... Oh, man. Damn, there's a dungeon here. Let's check it out. Murkwater Catacombs. Yeah, I don't know if I ever went in here before. So, it's not dark, right? No. Let's head down... I'm guessing there's going to be skeletons or... Ah, uh, these little doggies. Okay. Oh, there's another one. Okay, they're not too bad. Ah. Uh. <laughs> 
If you play it slow and safe, um, yeah, should be fine. <laughs> Okay, there's something over there. What's this? Trap ahead. Where? Where, 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 where? There's a lot of blood stains here. Oh, shit, they saw me. Okay, okay. Ah, I see the... Uh, yeah, is this a trap right here? Let's see what it does. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Killed one of them with the with their own trap? No, I didn't. Ah, shit. Oh, shit. Just barely survived all that. But maybe I can just use the trap against them. Yeah. Now there's only one of them left. Oh! There was another one. I didn't see him. Sneak bastards. Time for lover. Uh huh. Somewhere a heavy door has opened. Okay, cool. It sounds to my left in my headphones. I can hear it better. Okay, there's a dog there. Are these gonna come alive or? <laughs> and backstab me or something. There's a trap, I think. Let's see what it does. Okay, again. Three sets of arrows. Maybe I can use it against them. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Oh, the damage is actually quite good from these little guys. <laughs> Smithing stone. Oh, nearly stepped on it. Grass. What? Sneaky little bastards just coming out of nowhere. Oh, okay, and there's the boss. So, let's see what people write. Good luck. Try critical hit. Okay. I think I will rest, actually, and level up before I try the boss. And just run past all these guys. I think you can easily run past them if you're fast enough. Where was the bonfire? It's just here somewhere. Okay. Let's do intelligence for the damage. So, wait, where was it? Ah, if I run past, yeah, good. Avoid the traps. They just wake up, they're too slow. Oh, I ran out of stamina, damn it. And yeah, let's see what this is. Grave Warden. Oh, a dude with hammers. Ooh, I procced se what, 700 damage. What the hell? He's Maybe he's weak against ice. What? Ah, oh, it has like a little AoE kind of thing. I think one more ought to do it. Yep. Vanished Knight... Angval. Yeah, I don't think I ever got that before. So, that's cool. That was actually really easy. I think he was weak against ice magic. Or frostbite or whatever. Okay. Where to you? Interesting. Uh, 3,100 something. Uh, 
I should check to see if I can level up this staff at some point as well. Because I did go to the round table, so... Actually, that would be a good idea. Let's just do a quick little detour. Talk to that blacksmith guy there. I got some somber stones, so... Yeah, that should be good. But it already has S scaling, so I don't know. I'm just gonna skip his dialogues and stuff in case it's for something. Uh, where's the staffs? Oh, these are just weapons. Huh? Oh, okay. Yeah, so I guess that one you cannot upgrade. Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> cool. So, because, uh, yeah, I, I figured that might be the case, because it's already level, it has I Intelligent S, so, like, what is there to level up with this? I mean, I could imagine that the sorcery scaling would go higher and higher, but, yeah, that's that's kind of, I guess it's, like, people who put, like, 99 Intelligence, this is going to be the strongest one, or something, I don't know. Anyway, what a waste of time. Um... Yeah, where to next? I guess we can just ride up here. And maybe we could even fight Margate or whatever. Um, For the big boss fights, I'll try not to summon in. Unless it's for, like, quest line. Like, I think the one in the castle, you can s summon in that uh, girl, Nef Nefi, Nefi Lu. And I think that is part of her quest. Like, she's supposed to be there. Oh, shit. These guys are really going crazy. Let's just ride past them. Yeah, Trumpet Boy. So yeah, maybe with that boss I'll summon her in, but... Pretty sure you don't have to summon in the mage when you fight um, Margit. I don't think he even has a quest. Oh yeah, there's also the girl... Blah 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 blah. I don't even know what her name is. Okay, the jellyfish. Okay, she's done. Mm hmm. Let's just keep going. I don't think I need to heal. Um, okay, there's the catapult thing. Oh, there's a scarab here. Come on. There we go. Oh, they saw me. Okay, they're firing the, the cannon crossbow thing but if I go around it should be fine now we can take revenge on this guy oh shit Nice. So easy. And you get a bunch of experience for that. 3-1. Oh, maybe I, now would be a good, I, good time to actually use, like, a 400 one. Because if I die at the boss, you know, then you lose your souls. Makes no sense. 3-1. Oh, shit. I need, like, just... 10 souls or something. Okay, I'll just run outside real quick. There's probably an enemy somewhere there. Let's try going in the forest. Yep, perfect. There's a guy just here. Okay, whatever.
I could try him without the summon, and if he's too hard and I need something to take the aggro off of me, then yeah, I will try um, to use this sorcerer guy, since he's there anyways. Uh, oh, wow, wait, what? 55 to 66, that's it? Hmm. Maybe I will do Vitality. Also, at some point, I should start to put into Endurance as well. But, yeah, let's just try. Right here, you can summon the guy, but I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna try first by myself. Let's skip this. Oh, damage is not bad at all. And he got Frostbite. Oh man, he's in phase 2 already. Uh-oh. Let me heal real quick. Oh man. Oh shit. Wow, his... his... Range is pretty far with that stupid stick. Oh, I got him. First try. Okay, so ice... <laughs> ice magic is so strong. What? 12,000. No HP, no mana. Look at my bars. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, hmm. Three level ups. Could put it all into vigor, or some into endurance. Actually, that doesn't boost the. In that doesn't give you that much. Um, or intelligence. Maybe, I will go with vigor till it hits like twenty. Damn. First tried him. And I guess I could try to do the whole Storm Veil cast skip, which is opening this door and then just, you know, running up to the next bonfire. Uh, it's not easy, but it is possible. Can I just get the items here? Might as well. Some grease. Okay, totally useless items. And that one is across the way. You can't get it, so... Let's just go back. That was really close. But, yeah, even if I would have died against him, I probably would have gotten on the second or third try. He's not a very difficult boss, to be honest, for a caster. For a melee, it's a little bit harder, but also it's not, like, impossible or something. Oh, whoops, I actually didn't want to sit. So, let's get him to open the gate, so we can do the skip. Come on. I... It's time. Oh. Ah, you breached. Well, of course. So, you have to say no to him, and then just stand here. And those items are almost like traps. Um, I can still try to get them, though. As long as you run from side to side, you should be okay. Oh, shit. Or not. Just run like hell. And... Yeah. Let's see if we can skip this area. Oh, there's a guy coming. Okay. <laughs> okay, this part is also kind of hard because you have to get to the left without getting hit. Oh, shit. Okay. Oh, my God. Raw. There 
There we go. Now we just have to kill all these crossbow dudes so they stop shooting at us. Some have two, some have one. It's very annoying. Okay, now we can just run past all these guys. Get some stamina. Roll. Oh shit, I rolled into the guy's sword. And here we have again cro these guys shooting at us with crossbow stuff. If I stick next to the wall, I should be okay for a few seconds, and then, yeah, oh shit, there it is. Just have to get up here. Whoop. No, wrong potion. Oh shit, not good. Now I have no more potions. Oh my god. Okay, if I can just somehow run to the next bonfire without dying, it would be like a small miracle. <sighs> These fucking guys. Also the fucking dog and giant, but I just need to touch the bonfire. I don't need to rest at it. Oh, someone got me with a crossbow bolt. Ah, so close. It's just there. And then you can skip like half the castle. Damn it. So freaking close. Okay, we have to do it again. Hopefully this time I don't waste all my potions with this nonsense. Ah, uh, I timed it too early. But okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Also, we don't have to fight them all, we can just run past. I think I will take one safety guzzle. Just run. Oh shit, he's in my way. Oh fuck. Okay, I didn't want to actually fall down there. There is actually another, I think, um, bonfire, but it's past that wolf guy on the r on the right there. So yeah, okay. This this is I hate this part. This part sucks. Ah man, every time. No. <sighs> it's like impossible. Maybe I can kill those guys somehow. Maybe I will grab that other bonfire on the on the side there. Come on, dude. Oh, shit. I keep forgetting that they can just shoot you right here. Okay. Oh, I didn't make it! Let's try this bonfire. Just need to run past this stupid wolf. Oh, shit. But then you don't have to worry about this crossbows every time. I think there's a bonfire here. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, yeah, there is. Yeah, cool. I think going from this one is easier. Let's kill the wolf. See how much experience he gives us. Yeah, okay. See so you, dude. come in here? I don't think so. 
Wow. For a caster, it's like impossible. Oh my god, bruh. He can't come in here, so that's good. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, if he's in his, like, attacking animation, then it's... Whoa, it procced. Nice. I wonder if he comes back. Let's rest. <laughs> that was crazy. That felt a little bit exploity, but hey, whatever. I didn't code the game. It's not my fault he can't go uh, through this door. Yeah, he's dead. Now I can just sort of skip all these enemies if I sneak past them. Or I can just kill them. Yeah, maybe I should just kill them. Yeah, the axe guy was annoying. What? I rolled backwards? Okay, let me see if there's a way to do this kind of clever. <sighs> Whoop, there's a guy chucking urns at me. Oh shit, they can shoot at me from over there. Oh shit. Oh fuck. No, okay, but that is clearly a good way to go. There at least I can see when they fire at me. And I can sort of, you know, time it better. This castle is really annoying for casters. So I want to kill the axe guy first. And then any of them. Huh? Oh shit. They can interrupt me. So let's try this again. They didn't see me yet. Maybe I can kill this guy. Nice. Okay. One less potion, dude. Pot thrower. Okay, cool. Can I? Oh. Damn, it doesn't reach him. Oh, it does reach him. Okay, that's good. One down. So, oh, one of the bodies had an item. Just a mushroom. Damn it, I jumped all the way down for nothing. So, okay, that's good to know. That I can kill one of those crossbow guys. No problem. The other one, I don't know. We have to see. Where is he? Oh. Oh, he's quite... He's quite far. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I can... Yep, now's the time to run like hell. Oh. Okay. Drink a potion. Let's make this a little bit easy. Okay, now I just have to run past all of these guys. Come 
one. Okay. Okay, I think I can make it if I don't get hit too much now. Um, alternatively, I can run this way. I think there's less enemies over here. And also, maybe the giant won't aggro. I don't know. Let's see. Whoop, nearly got hit there. Come on, so close. Yeah, I made it. Nice. Very good. And now, oh, we can rest. And also, I can go and clean up this whole area to collect the items and stuff. I don't have to do the whole castle, but if I'm here, I might as well grab what I can grab, you know. Oh, he's still alive. Stupid dog. Where's the chonky boy here? Nice. Omen Cleaver. Cool. A painting. Okay. Let's see if I... I don't want to, like, get them all aggroing me, so I'll just kill the ones that... threaten me in some way. Oh, here's another one. Let's check what's inside here. Up we go. Oh, another guy. Oh, he was an axe dude. Okay. Shit. <laughs> are like in their own world. Okay, cool. They, none of them attack me. Okay, I see a rat, which means there's probably going to be more rats. No. Hmm. Kiting, kiting. Oh, I thought I killed this one. Kiting, 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 and everyone is dead. Okay. Oh, what's this here? Let's try, why not? Secret area. With a chest, two chests. Ooh. God Slayer's Seal. Okay, but I'm not doing Faith Build. And a Prayer Book. It's cool, I guess, but yeah. I'm not doing uh, any Faith stuff. I don't think there are any Ice Faith spells, so... yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna run up here... There are two dudes patrolling. Maybe I can just quickly get in here. Is it even worth... Oh, no. This is just leading to the... Yeah, it's not really worth going this way. So I might just go back. Oh, shit. Some of them saw me. Oh, no. Let's get out of here before it's too late. Maybe I stay up here for a second. Yeah. I knew they would chase me up here and waste time, you know. So I can easily escape. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> He's breakdancing. So, that was a pretty easy shortcut, right? Like, uh, now we can get to the boss. Shouldn't be too bad.
Let me level up a little bit more health. And... Yeah. Let's see if I can go this way. Here's these, like, really annoying birds, but maybe... I can get a hit. Oh, no. Oh, not good. They seem to have three... Yep, three hits to kill them. There's one more. I'm not going to take any chances. Maybe I can... Can't I just, like... Yeah. Yeah, very nice. I got him. Oh, crossbow guy. Oh, man. So many enemies here. And this is Nefli Lu. We're harnessed. I am the fan here by the crown. Otis Graft is tainted them. I think we'd need to summon her in the next fight. Not that she hit... I will probably do the most damage anyways to the to the boss with my spells. But I think she is needed to survive in that fight to progress her quest line. So I might actually do that. No big deal. Oh, okay, here's some more dudes. I'm going to quickly maybe kill the little guys if I can. And we fought this guy before, so I'm pretty sure we can take him down. He's almost dead. There we go. Easy. Cool, I made it. Okay, so this is the boss fight now. Uh, 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 oh no, I need a lot of souls to level up, so... <sighs> okay, let's try fighting this boss. And, yeah, I'll get the Scarab later. Let's first do the boss real quick. I think she will anyways just join once I start the fight. Okay, there he is. The big boy. Oh, wow. Look at that. He got frostbitten. Oh, shit. Already got hit. I think I should only cast three, so I have some stamina to roll and stuff. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit, I should have healed, I guess. Oh, if you run really quick at him, like this... He can't hit you. Roll. Roll. Yeah. Oh, shit. Who's he? Oh, he's going for the girl. He might actually kill her, which I don't want to happen. My brother's ringing at the door. One second. Got to. Let me just kill this. Okay, awesome. I'll be right back. Just one sec. Okay, this is anyways a pretty good place to <laughs> leave off. Uh, someone was ringing at my door, so I have to go. But yeah, that was easy. That was a pretty easy boss fight. So I will see you all in the next video. I'm not going to level up now, so I can do it in the next one.
Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.